n element sigma of s5 symmetric group of five symbols and matrix a is 5 cross 5 matrix such that such that ith column of a is sigma ith column of the identity matrix what it means ith column of a so ith column of a suppose this is a matrix a and its ith column will be the sigma ith column of the identity matrix so this is sigma i sigma ith column of the identity matrix so when we find sigma i if we put uh, one one sigma then sigma one one is sending to two so sigma one is two it means this is identity matrix value of is two so Column of identity matrix means 0, 1, 0, 0, 0 because of this size of the matrix is 5 cross 5. Similarly, you can find uh, other, eigen, other columns of this uh, matrix. Then sigma 2, sigma 2 value is 1. So 1, 0, 0, 0, 0. Sigma 3, 3 is going to 3. So 0, 0, 1, 0, 0. Sigma 4, 4 is going to 5, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, and 5 is going to 4, 0, 0, 1, 0. So this is matrix A, and we know that A square equals to identity. That's why A square equals to identity. Now, W is spanning by set identity A, A square, and so on. Indirectly, we can write because of a square is identity. Uh, it means uh, this spanning set is nothing but identity comma a having two elements, and we know that dimension of subspace uh, never exceed number of spanning element, number of spanning spanning elements. So dimension of w because this is spanned by two element, and these two are these two elements are linearly independent. So dimension of W is 2, option B is correct.